Welcome back, everybody. It's your boy, Element OP. Uh, let's go ahead and refresh if you haven't. Obviously, you wouldn't be able to hear me if, anyways. Uh, so, uh, I think we got it all figured out. We're gonna go ahead and get the show started, but we cannot get started until we see at least 10 mogul lighters in the chat. So, go crazy with the mogul lighters, and then we'll start the show. And if not, then we can just, you know, end stream. We'll see you next week. And uh, maybe maybe we'll go from there. Sonia, welcome to the stream. Yes, love the mobile lighters. Let's go. All right, y'all. We're gonna go ahead and get the show started. Uh, thank you so much. And uh, everyone ready? Yeah. Mic check. Mic check. All right, let's go. See y'all later. What's up, what's up everybody? How y'all doing? It's good to see everybody in the chat. Welcome into the Mogul House Live. Hi guys, welcome back. So glad to see you. I see all these lighters in here. Y'all hype tonight. We already had a hype train too, man. <laughs> that's what I love to hear. I love to see it, love to see it. So glad to see all of you guys in here. Hey Lyrica. Mama Guate's in here, Space Monkey. Hi, Malia. Hello, hello. <laughs> yes, Estra, it's great to see you as well. Yo, the Indie Brothers are in here. What's up? And Sierra Pants, hello. Chicken Wing Dip, send me some. <laughs> <laughs> Mail me some. God, stomach already sticking out. Mm -mm. Need to put nothing else in here. Mm -mm. <laughs> Welcome in. Hey, B. Marie. Hi, everybody. Good to see you all. Welcome in to the Mogul House Live. It's Bishop here. It's honestly good, I bet. I'm over here thinking about it. Um, as you can see right now, I am smiling from ear to ear. And you know why? Because we have the infamous, the <laughs> jaw-dropping, the amazing, the stunning Miss Aston Tur here with us. And I'm, this is going to be an unforgettable night. I can't stop smiling already. The sound check, I was just in the other room like, whew, okay, be good, be good. Yes, Aston. Hey, Sunflower. Good to see you. Aston, how you doing? I'm good. Yeah? Yeah, I'm nervous. I don't know why. Because <laughs> I, don't, I don't know. This is new to me. I love this stuff. Yeah, yeah. Well, we already love you here in the mogul community and on Twitch as well. We have... Uh, Heathy's hand in, in, in the shot. Got a little feature there. <laughs> yeah. Aston, um, you rock you rocked us last week. I literally sat there like, I could end the night like this and just keep looking. I was done. I was absolutely done. Thank you. God. You're from LA originally? Uh Pasadena. Pasadena. That okay. doesn't count as LA. It does not count. Okay. All right. That's good to know. Cause I don't know these things. I'm I'm a uh, Cincinnati boy. Right, so, yeah. yeah. Now you know. I know. Pasadena, born and raised. Mm -hmm. You have any siblings? Yeah, I have a brother who's like seven and a half years older than me, and then okay. my sister is like eight and a half years older than me. I was a surprise. Yeah, got yeah. you. Your brother, actually, I follow him on Instagram. He's funny. Yeah, he's. Yeah. <laughs> we love him. Yeah. He's crazy. He plays drums. Yeah. Okay, yeah. 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 I think you had posted something one day on the Was first... he flying in the mall? <laughs> no. Okay. Because that's a thing. Anyway. I don't know why I remember <laughs> this to this day, but I remember him like, y'all was playing church and he was going in. <laughs> And he, like, gave it to us. He said, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah, absolutely. Literally, I don't know what it is, but, like, as soon as I walk in my parents' house, yeah. I just want to start screaming. Yeah. <laughs> We're all so loud. Like, why are we screaming? Why are we screaming? It's literally I, I nine. Know. I do that, too. The loudest house on the block. Yeah, yeah. Our neighbors are probably, like, white. Oh, okay, they're home. The kids yeah, are home. the yeah, kids yeah. are home. God, <laughs> shut up. Oh, man. Aston's Flying brother. in the... Okay, I have yeah. to tell them. There's a video of him doing, like, martial arts moves in the mall. <laughs> but he's doing, like, this kick, and he's, like, flying through the air. It, 
<laughs> no what? one told him to do this. Yeah, yeah. Very unprompted. And he put like Atari uh, game music behind the video. So what? it's just, <laughs> it's kind of ridiculous. I can't see that. Yeah. That, yeah that not it's a that. lot. Yes. Oh, man. As you can tell already, we're going to have a good time. <laughs> I have never met him, but I think he's hilarious. Yeah, so he's funny. I would love to meet him one day. But then also you have an older sister. Her name is Toya. Yeah, Toya. Toya, Toya yeah. Yep. And y'all all are musical. Yeah. Where does that come from? Anybody in your, your parents? Um, my mom, she was a background singer for a really long time. And okay. then a vocal coach. And she taught kids music. And wow. Yeah. So okay. pretty much from... My mom's side of the family. Nice, nice. Mm -hmm. That's really cool. Excellent. Pasadena, you got a big family. Dad musical, or he just kind of like, he's mm. the one that's holding everything together. He's holding. He's the pastor. Oh, he's the pastor. Yeah. Okay. Wait, so you grew up in a a, a church home? Oh, yeah. Okay. All oh, right. yeah. So, yeah, tell us a little bit about that. Are, are they still pastoring now? Yeah, they yeah. are. They still do in Pasadena. My sister leads worship. My okay. brother's the MD. Okay. I'm like the only one who's not there, yeah. but <laughs> it's fine. Nobody feels upset about it. That's I just good. feel sad sometimes because I'm not yeah. you know, around as much. But yeah, they're still there. Growing up, a pastor's kid was like interesting, but uh -huh. I feel like I err on the more like... Uh, edgy yeah. pastor's kid right, then right. like I, I didn't really care about yeah. the usual things pastor's kids care about because yeah. I was just like no this, right. I'm not doing that right, yeah. so <laughs> yeah we're definitely going to get in because I've heard a little bit about this earlier I can't wait to hear more about this this personality that you have oh, it's great man. well welcome into to Mocha House Live everybody Keaton what's up man hey Keaton guess what it ain't Fireball, but it's close to it, brother man. We're going to get you an emote made for the Fireball. <laughs> hey, Jenny Blue, welcome in. Hi, everybody. I'm sitting here with my good friend, Aston Turr, and uh, we're going to hear some music from her tonight. What's your first song you're going to sing for us? Um, it's called Too Soon. Too Soon. Mm -hmm. Oh, this, this, okay. <laughs> now, you, let's, let's go ahead and take a sip already. Command sip. <laughs> Let the sip come in exactly. Sunflower, you beat crying, me to it. Crying. Yes, because um, mm. man, I'm gonna need something to calm my cheeks down. I'm just smiling. <laughs> Good lord! All right, this is too soon by Aston Turner. My name is Bishop, and it's gonna be an amazing time here, right here in the Mogul House. Check this out. Well, it's before noon. It might be too soon to say I love you, but I do. Is it too It's about time for you to be mine again, like you were the day before and the one before then. Oh, I hope it's not too much. Yeah. 
It's almost midnight Thought it might be right The right time to ask you If you That half step on the E. Ah, dang, thank you. Woo, man. Oh Who did I just see? That I just saw someone. Hey. Oh, my big brother's like, what's up, man? Yo, so that, <laughs> what in the world? Mm -hmm. Who are you? <laughs> that was amazing. Thank you. Too soon. What is the story behind Too Soon? Oh, God. Um, it's, uh, really simple and almost embarrassing but it really is the truth um we all developed I don't know if we all did but a lot of my friends and people I know developed really interesting coping mechanisms in the quarantine mm. I was like it's actually way too early in the day for me to like smoke. Yeah. <laughs> That's literally where it came from. Yeah. And then I was like, okay, we can make it about other things. Right. But the initial thing was like, it's before 12 p.m. Yeah. It's way, way too, too soon. Right. It's way right. too soon. <laughs> Ashton, you need to relax. Yeah. Anyway, that's where that came from. A wow. song can come from anything, you guys. That's it. Well, and that is it. Can we just wait till noon? Like at least till like noon. Who drink soda at nine? I'm like, that's too much. That's what I'm saying. Yeah, yeah. Like it's way too soon to be yeah. doing that. Well, just wait. Let's just hold on. Yeah, because there may be a little bit of a day we may we, need to interact need, with. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> like you know, just yeah. Um, who are, who are your influences to where you're hearing da da da, and then the chord is. Da, da, da. <laughs> But where are you getting that stuff from? Oh, man. Uh, well, at the time, I was listening to a lot of Madison Cunningham. And she, first of all, I don't even think she plays in standard tuning. So a lot of her uh, chord choices are just, yeah. yeah. The first time I heard the out, her most recent album, I was driving to Vegas for my sister's birthday. Uh -huh. And I was just like, yeah. <laughs> So many people had told me about it before, and I was like, what the hell? Why did I wait so long right, to listen right. to her? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, but yeah, it just the way that she yeah. thinks, I was like, that is cool. Yeah. Like, just to, the rest of the song is not hard. Like, right. the chords are not that strange. It's just that one. Right, right. So yeah, she, she was uh, inspiring me for yeah, sure. Yeah, dang. That's awesome. A song is simple. Basically, it's too soon to just be doing whatever you want to do. Just to be doing whatever you want to do. Just, yeah. do, just right. wait. Yeah. Just give it a moment. Wake maybe. Up. Dude, maybe. Yeah. Sometimes it is like, it's like so, <laughs> sometimes it's like you it know ain't what? Too soon. Today? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa. Not I need it today. It. Do you guys know who Madison Cunningham is? You should. Uh, well, yeah. You check check her out. Check her out. Um, I know I see, I think we've, we've had Izzy on here before, uh, but again, also I gotta say this, everybody's been showing so much love tonight, look at this, Starburst, thank you so much for gifting all these subs, Keaton, resubscribing, Andy Brothers gifting subs, you guys are amazing, thank you Dennis, everybody, thank you, thank you, thank you so much for all of the new followers as well, Sierra Pants, uh, Tom Photo Video, love you guys, much love to y'all, we got Aston Turry right here in the Mogul House right now, and she's live with us tonight, and yeah, it's going to be a hell of a night. Okay, too soon. What we got next? Um, She was. She was. This yeah. is a, That was an original, right? Too soon. Too soon was original yeah. from uh -huh. you. Yes. And so she was. Is this original as well? Yes, it is. <sighs> I'm not going to be able to take this. All right. <laughs> Y'all, my name is Bishop. I can't even talk. My name is Bishop. Welcome to the Mogul House Live. So glad to see you all here tonight. We have our friend Aston Turner, and she's about to sing She Was. Check this out. Oh, she was so beautiful. Eyes like crystal. 
crystal skies in springtime mm. And she, she was so sweet to me Kind of smile these eyes have ever seen mm. But on and on And she passes by Like an airplane made of paper And all at once it's five or six years later gets me as well <laughs> mercy she was mm -hmm. so okay my favorite line in that i don't know why i don't know it's just the way you sing it on and on on and on and on and on it goes did i sing it right on and on, on and, on and on and on and on life goes <laughs> what's wrong with you a lot that's why i write these songs <laughs> Hello. <laughs> on and on and on, life goes. It does go on, doesn't it? Yeah. All right. So why why are we saying that? What's happening? Like what what? Um, all, tell me. Come on. <laughs> this also came from like a silly, uh, like thought or whatever. I was on Instagram or Twitter or something. There's a meme that was like, one day we went outside with our like neighborhood friends for the last time. We just didn't know it. And I was like, dang, that's true. Because I used to be outside all the time with my friends doing whatever. Yeah. And then, I don't know, all of a sudden, we stopped doing that. And then that made me think about how, like, our, like, I don't know, childhood, like, innocence and wonder just all of a sudden one day, like, yeah. goes away. Right. But we don't really know when that happened or yeah. how it happened. It's just, like, that's why on and on and on yeah. life goes. Like, right. nobody knows what happened right, right. or, like, um, what's the... Uh, no one knows but time... And she passes by like a paper airplane, and then like mm. all of a sudden, it's like, oh shit! It's five or six years after yeah. I saw that happening the first time, and now like, where did where the did time go? go? Yeah, and yeah, yeah. yeah. Dang, so that's so true, though. I feel like often that is the case where, it, especially when you look on TV, and like we just had the Super Bowl, and it's like the halftime was so nostalgic. Mm -hmm. Fifty Cent, mm -hmm. I was like, oh man, I was like twelve, thirteen. Mm -hmm. Everybody's doing the down away. Mm -hmm. or, you know? mm -hmm. <laughs> and now it's different in everything and how people process and how people engage with art and the artists that are out now is yeah. different. 
Thank you. Yeah, that's, super. Yeah, where did life go? Wow, that's a, that's good. I am I'm perplexed. Um, <laughs> in the best way. I know. Damn, I felt that too, Chad. <laughs> 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 I don't it's know why just the ready. truth. It is the truth. Welcome in, everybody. Hi, Shellis. Welcome in. How you doing? Raina, Mystique, all you great people. Welcome in to the Mogul House Live. As you can see, we have this, the incredibly talented and beautiful Aston Tur here with us. Janet Y, thank you for the follow. And also, Shellis rated us as well. Thank you for the raid, Shellis. Appreciate you. Much love to you. Hope you're doing well. Um. So, Okay. Overall, who were the people you listened to growing up? Like, what, what were your influences? Um, uh, this question is so difficult because yeah. I had such a, a vast music like library as a child because I grew up super churchy. I, I'm not a super churchy person, right. but I grew up like the most Pentecostal you could be. Okay. So I grew up listening to a ton of gospel music yeah. and then like my parents loved Motown and like right. all those guys. Um, so I listened to that a lot. And then I had my siblings who were listening to more like R&B, hip hop stuff. So mm-hmm. like my sister is the biggest Brandy fan that ever was or will oh, be. Same. Yeah, right, like, <laughs> and I understand. Yeah. So I ha- I listened to a lot of her growing up. I okay. listened to a lot of Kim Burrell. Ooh, um, yes. I listened to a lot of like Stevie Wonder. I still do. Yeah. Uh, probably obsessively. Yeah. <laughs> and uh, yeah, but then I started venturing out to like kind of my own taste and then okay. i started listening to stuff like paramore like oh yeah i freaking love Haley williams Good that girl be in here right now she would lose it oh my god i lo- she like would, she would lose it literally i love one time one time i posted a, a Haley williams song and she put it on her story and i almost died wow i almost really That's left huge. this world mm-hmm. that happens to you a lot though let's talk about this because Let's not. <laughs> no. Y'all, this girl's famous. Like, I feel famous, like, sitting next to her right now. You have, you'll do a video and some crazy, like, singer star will, like, repost it because they love your voice. Do you know what you have? I don't think you do. <laughs> I don't think you do. Me. I mean, um. Ye- Yeba reposted something, right? Yeah, I, I had. Or Yeba, yeah, I don't know how to say she, it. Yeah, but yeah, uh, yeah. she has a song called October Sky. Yeah. And there's like a uh, produced out version of it, but mm-hmm. the version that I was really like, and just the first like <laughs> minute, mm-hmm. I was obsessing over it. Yeah. And I was like, you know what? Let me just put my own little, little on spin. it. Yeah. Just yeah. to like get it out of my head, really. Right. And then I posted it and she wrote so it. It's like, I'm going to throw it That is crazy. Yeah, I mean Haley her. Williams. The list does go on. You've been doing a lot of covers with, uh, uh, what's is it Scary Pockets? Yeah, okay, yeah, stuff. Like yeah, that. they're fun. Yeah, yeah, they're really fun. You definitely are someone that when I and I'm not gonna get into this right now as much, but when I see you, I go, we will we will be getting tickets at an arena to watch you sing one day. I do feel like that. I'm not joking. I'm very serious, Aston. Thank you. We say it all the time around here when we hear you, and it's just such a privilege to have you in this space. But would you go and see Aston at an arena? I would. <laughs> I, I would pay top dollar because I, when I think of you, I don't think that you are the same as Adele, but the attention Adele or the attention, um, uh, what's his name, Red Hair, um, God. Um, yeah. Yes, you know what I'm talking about. What is his name, God. Lord? What is that guy's I name? I can only think of his Instagram that's like Teddy, right? What's Ed Sheeran? Thank you, Ed wow, Sheeran. Wow, my God. <laughs> yeah. It's it's not even so much that you remind me of them. It's more just like they were rawly talented. You do, They didn't need a lot to surround. You know, some of us, we need a little help, you know? <laughs> you don't need any help at all. Thank you. You just are amazing. So... Yeah, that's right. Ed Sheeran. Thanks, Shellis. Thank you, guys. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we yeah. needed help. Right, just a little help. Mm-hmm. Wow, she was. That's great. Um, okay, I've heard you sing covers from Coldplay before. Yeah, I'm actually going to do one. Shut up. Yeah. Oh, I didn't know. I honestly did not know that. Yeah, I'm very excited. It was, a, um, it was an audible because, you know... I didn't have my song list until <laughs> you did it. like 30 minutes ago. Yeah, you're supposed to have it this morning for me. Yeah, okay. <laughs> but you know, like, sometimes you wake up and you're like, 
I still don't know what the vibes are. Yeah. So, <laughs> yeah. That's great. Okay. So what Coldplay song are you doing? I'm going to do Sparks. Sparks. Yeah. All right. But well, she's going to do Sparks. While we're doing Sparks, I want to do a poll right now. What is your favorite Coldplay song? Oh, shoot. Um, do you like Yellow? Um, dang. I'm about to f- f- uh, slip up here. What's the one I always sing on stream? Thank you. Fix you. Mm, Good God. Mm, mm. Viva La Vida. Viva La Vida or Magic. Mm, mm, mm. I play Magic so much that people think that I wrote it. That you wrote it. Yeah. Well, I do remember seeing you. You had a mic and you didn't have your and you were just singing it and I did screen record it and. <laughs> Shamelessly. When was this? I don't know. You were at something and like they was passing the mic around. And oh, girl, you grabbed the mic, started probably singing. Probably my it. friend's birthday party. Ooh, I don't think Coldplay should ever sing that again after that. All right, I'm not saying anything. That's blasphemous. Oh! No. Okay. Yeah, we're leaving that yeah. comment out. We're editing it out. Yes, we will. We. I love Coldplay. I'm Me obsessed too. with them. Same. Yeah. All oh, right. that's another. Uh, who I grew up listening to really? later on. Yeah, yeah, Coldplay. I love that. I love it. Okay, give me the song name again that you're doing. I Sparks. Guess. Thank you. I'm, I'm all over the place tonight, y'all. I'm just so so into it. We got Aston Tur here at the Mogul House Live. My name is Bishop, and she's about to play Sparks by Coldplay. Check this out. Did I drive you away? I know what you'll say and say no. Same one you know. But I promise you this. what I'll do and sing out and cry
Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Wow. I saw sparks too. <laughs> I started closing my eyes and stuff. <laughs> Almost to the head. Mm-mm. Right. Oh, God. Y'all ain't that amazing. Right. At rest in peace, Bishop. You ain't never lied dropping my phone. <laughs> God. I can't interview people I'm like like really fans of. I don't think that's I should do this anymore. Because that is, yeah. Okay. That was Sparks by Coldplay, um, a.k.a. Aston. And... Um, she just murdered that. Why? Why that song? Why? Like, is that one of your favorites? Or yeah, that okay. whole album, the uh, Parachute album. That's her first one. Yep. I remember. I used to like. I really beat that album down. Yeah. I mean, ooh, <laughs> I used to listen to it every day. Freshman yeah. year of college, I was like, it was like I had never heard it before in my yeah, life, yeah. which is not true. Right, <laughs> but right, yeah. I, yeah, I really. I don't know. Yeah. Got into that. But I love them yeah. and I love that album. And yeah. I understand. I had an encounter like that. <laughs> I don't know why I said encounter, but it was literally Cause, like. Because it is. <laughs> it, is. <laughs> it is. I get it. My, my little Xylo tears me to shreds. <laughs> like when they go out of uh, um, Hurts Like Heaven into the little Charlie Brown. Mm-hmm, like, mm-hmm. I can't take that. <laughs> <laughs> I just can't. Then us against the world. I literally mm. can't. I can't take that. I used to cover that one too, but oh. it'd be making me cry. So I'm like, uh. Okay, well, if you yeah. feel like crying tonight, we may have to just bring that out. Yeah, we'll see. We'll see. Man, did y'all enjoy that? Uh okay. So favorite <laughs> Coldplay song. What 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 is our answer here? What do we have? So fix you is winning. Fix you is winning. Fix you is winning. Are you guys okay? Thirteen percent. Oh, okay. Fifty-four percent. Fix you wins. Nice. That's a great one. Lights will guide. You. I'd be covering that one too, but it'd be making me cry. Yeah, yeah. So I, when I first started streaming, justice I, for people would be dead. Cool. I heard that. I love that song. Bishop, we th- you think we not? <laughs> I know, right? Wait, Keaton, where is this Papa John's coming from? I need to pay attention to the chat. <laughs> <laughs> I need some. Send me some pizza too, man. Okay. Um. Yeah. Fix you is one of those songs I started singing on stream when I first started streaming. Yeah. And one time I I started thinking about the words. It got me good. Yeah. It'll yeah. do that to you. Yeah, man. It's a worship song. So okay, when it comes to writing, yeah, who, who are would it be Coldplay or who are the people you're paying attention to the most? Um. Well, yeah, Coldplay is definitely one of them. Melody wise, like yeah. I just love. What they do, um, and like how they just make you feel stuff. Yeah. 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 I, I like making people feel stuff. Yeah. Even though I don't, and you know why? It's because I don't like feeling things, and all of my songs are really like, yeah. We're all, we're feel yeah. Yes. So we're all about to do this. I if do. I gotta do, do it, it, you gotta do it too. You gotta do yeah. it too. Yes. Yeah. Um, so Coldplay, um, again, Stevie Wonder, his mm. uh, progressions are just, what? Right, yeah. Like who? <laughs> Just how? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Have you heard um, "Summer Soft"? It's a deep cut. It's off songs in the key of life, and the first oh, like yeah, two. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. The yeah. first two seconds, I'm already in. Right, I'm like, how yeah. you do that? <laughs> Incredible. I know. Incredible. Yeah, Stevie. Yeah. Yeah. It's, the way they heard music though in the '80s, it was so different. different. Yeah. Because yeah. I'm a big Patti LaBelle fan too. The, Ooh, come on. I, I mean, I had Patti records over there for days. Yeah. And there are certain things that. Like her hits, everybody loves, right? Mm-hmm. But like the one song, I'm in love again. This time I mean it, in love again. All the transition, this time is for real. All the changes, it's just like they, it's so good. Yes, yeah, I know. like you guys really knew what you were doing. You did, yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah. Yes, but on the newer side of things, I I love, and I mean, love both these ladies. Emily King and Leanne Le Havis. Mm, mm. Yeah, Leanne's like pretty much why I started uh, like playing guitar okay. the way that I be playing guitar. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So love her, both of them. I love Emily King so much. She oh, like she's awesome. I didn't know even remotely what I like kind of wanted to sound like ever mm-hmm. until I heard her, and I was like. Yeah. Oh my God. Yeah, Emily King is amazing too. Yeah, yeah. Q, where yeah. have you been all my life, yeah. Ariana? 
my gosh, yeah. Man, that's cool. That's you have a lot of different uh it's what is uh, sister Mary Claire said, you got to be eclectic. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you are eclectic in the way that you see music and how you engage with it. That's dope. Thank you. Yeah, I love it. I love it. Are you guys enjoying yourself so far? I am. And we're only three songs in. Goodness gracious. Dang. And there are a lot of people in here. Thank you guys for hanging out with us here at the Mogul House Live. We got Aston Tur here right now. Um, Aston, uh, what are you about to sing for us next? I think I'm going to sing 24. <sighs> Let me get my drink. Hey, can we get a sip right now? <laughs> Let's just go ahead and take a pre-sip. Everybody just get command sip. I don't know how many sips we are already in, but I just... I'm a few sips in, Oh, really? Three sips in, Sonata? Okay. Well, it looks like we got a lot of sipping to do here. Everybody, <laughs> take a sip right now. 24. Aston, you are 24 right now, right? Yeah. You're about to be 25. About to. Uh, June. <laughs> okay, yes. Yeah, so I got some lines. time. Yeah, this song will really, like, you'll be in it for a little bit. Yeah. Just, yeah. <laughs> I mean, I'm in it now because it's my life, Ooh. but um, yeah, I always tell people like the best and worst thing about writing a song yeah. about like something mm -hmm. is the fact that you, now it's never going away. Right. You yeah. literally just immortalize <laughs> that yourself. whole thing. Every time I sing some of these songs, I'm like, wow, I really wrote this about the dumbest person I know. Yeah. yeah. That is so crazy to me, yeah. but it's still nice. <laughs> it's still a nice song. Sorry, I obviously that. I have yes. um, uh, well, uh, relationship trauma, yeah, excuse me, yeah, yeah. just popped out a little bit. The dumbest person. Yeah, the dumbest well, person. Well, I want to thank the dumbest person that you know <laughs> for this song. <laughs> Wherever you are, dummy, thank you so much. May you live prosperly, may you have a great life. Uh, I'm just Because screaming. we are blessed because of your idiocracy. <laughs> All right? <laughs> Welcome to the Mogul House, everybody. so funny. Oh, my God. Man, my name is Bishop. We got ass in here, and She's about to perform my favorite song uh, that she sings. It's called 24. Check this out. Thanks. So much pressure. Yeah, it's okay. Okay, let's see. <clears throat> Tell me what's the matter. What could be so bad about a goodbye? If we swam in rivers of tears that you cried I, I didn't mean to go there But where do I start? Where do I start? There's nothing you can say And nothing you can do to change my heart Oh, but I just can't take it no longer Waiting for you to be stronger What if I need someone to lean on? You just wouldn't be the one Not for me And then I give it, and when you get it, you act like you don't even know my name. I'm just 24 and nothing more, but I'm too old to play these games. Oh, I just can't take it no
No longer? I can't take it no longer. <laughs> oh, are you okay over there? No, I'm sweating. God, Me wait. too, honestly. <sighs> Man. Mm. Thank <laughs> you. I, right? Everybody is just wow. I'm wow. Mm -hmm. I'm unwell. Me too. <laughs> yes. I love unwell so much. Um, I too am unwell. That's why I write these songs like this. <laughs> we could be unwell together. Yeah, same. I had to put my headphones because I wanted to hear what everybody was hearing too in there. <laughs> oh. Oh, Y'all don't even know what to do, where to go. Thanks, Inked. Gift and a sub to Yasmin. Thank you so much. Much love to Inked for life. <laughs> I know, because I sure <laughs> will. Laugh. I think I do identify with their songs much, so I like it. Yeah. Yeah. Heartbreak, it hits sticks. It sticks with you long. Yeah. I feel like one, because when you are with someone, and you, it's the most intimate part of your life when you extend and let people in. Yeah. And then when they like, when they fuck something up, it's like, oh, for real? Yeah. Okay, cool. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> like, that's what you want to do? Right. Yeah. What? Yeah. I remember you talking about this at Untapped last year a little bit. You said something so pointed, but also it hit deep. Like, I forget, it was something like, they they don't deserve something. You had said something. I was like, man, it's good. I don't know if you remember what you said, but. Nope. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> tell tell us a little bit about if whatever you're comfortable sharing about 24. Yeah. Um, I think first of all, what was oh okay, I was talking to this dude, and I was he said some really just like wild stuff that I was like, this is I'm not into this for me, mm. and then it's like he got kind of like frustrated for me for saying like this is the end of us talking, and I'm like. Mm -hmm. You think I'm going to wait for you to, like, yeah. figure your shit out? Because, yeah. no. Right, right. Yeah. <laughs> but I can't, I can't wait for that. I can't wait for you. You're not even doing, like, things that you should be right. doing. Like, like yeah. yeah. Especially if I'm expressing it to you. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm not going to wait around for a long time to see it. Yeah. Especially not right now. Yeah. <laughs> I am 24. That's young. Yeah, I don't need to is. be, do like, That's very true. You dealing are. with all... Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so it's just the end of that, and yeah. I wrote a song about it and closed the book. I love that. Mm -hmm. I, love, I love that you had enough respect for yourself to, to close that book. Oh, how to. I've had a lot of people in hopes that, because that means you kind of, you know who you are. A lot of people don't know who they are, so they'll stay in something long and mm -hmm. allow themselves to be mistreated or words to be said over them that to engage with longer just in hopes that it'll turn around yeah. because there is a feeling of security when you are with someone yeah you know? absolutely but sorry I'll I be dissecting this no it's okay I that. just I was raised in the school of let me tell you about my granny okay okay yeah she, I was literally on the phone with her the other day and mm. actually this is a perfect example of like what kind of woman she is and this is literally me. Yeah. She was talking about my grandfather. I never met him. He died when my mom was super young mm. and uh, she was like, yeah, we were married for a long time and then he just wanted to start telling me what to do and like controlling my stuff. So I said, oh, you. divorce. Yeah. <laughs> I was like... <laughs> But T, because me, you want to tell me what to do and all the yeah. divorce, right? Yeah, divorce, divorce. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. So that's cool. So you are an old soul in that way, yeah. especially uh, Repco of your grandmother. I'm an old soul anyway. Yeah, yeah. But yeah, that that is one. Yeah, that is one. Hey like, man, I just can't take it no longer. That gets Sing. me. Da, da, da. What is the words right there? Uh, waiting for you to be stronger. Waiting for you to be stronger. Mm -hmm. See if I have someone to lean on. Mm -hmm. This gets me. If you just wouldn't be the one. I just lose my entire Sing. shit after you do that. Every Sing. time you're like, oh God, that's good. <laughs> I love, yeah. I love while I'm singing, hearing you try to compose yourself. I was trying. It's really so good I, to me. I it's think, the yeah. Oh, oh wow, God. Yeah, thank Jeez. you. Yes. Oh my goodness, guys. I hope you're enjoying this so much. Man, <laughs> this is crazy. Oh, Bishop can sing. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, the, listen, Indies. I can't. You guys know. I just can't take good singing like that. <laughs> Man, okay, so 
gospel music wise, mm. I need to know who are your what's your Mount Rushmore? Mount Rushmore would be like four. Dang. Top four is it four people or five? How many presidents on Mount Rushmore? Four? Look, I don't know. That's what, some white like people. We all stuff. went to school. <laughs> God, somebody in the chat help us right now. Right. I don't know. Hey, nobody. I think it's four, right? Look. It's four. Okay. Educate me yeah, today. Yeah, yeah. I don't know. <laughs> We're all out of college, everyone. She said, not you asking us about that white history. Uh, Dang, black history. Oh my month. gosh. Sorry, uh, Shellis. Wow. Oh my God. Oh my <laughs> wow. Uh, this is a shame. Well, I mean, yes. Okay. Mount Rushmore gospel four, top four. Dang. Um, we're gonna top mm-hmm. four in no particular order. Kimberella's up there. No matter how mean she is. Yes. She's mean. She's mean, but, but it's... But, oh my God. Yes, but mean, it, it comes out Ooh, mean, too. And it's so beautiful. mean. It's, it's so it's, mean. It's, it's mean Ooh. and beautiful. <laughs> yeah. Um, uh, Mary Mary, I listened to them Definitely. nonstop. I didn't really have a choice yeah. with actually any of those that They're I'm about local, to tell you. right, too? Yeah, so my... My dad's church is in the Church of God in Christ, and they were in the, the church. The Culture Church. Yeah. Oh, you called it. Yeah, I told oh. you about his Pentecostal. Yeah, yeah, that can... is. Yeah, right. You would never get that by like the way that I play music. <laughs> I think it was just funny, but um, yeah. So Kimberell, Mary, Mary, Yolanda Adams, Ooh. Cece Winans. Ooh, now you don't play with me. Like, because I love a Cece. Oh my I God! I used moment. to sing. Um, I love a throne. What's moment. the song? Jesus, you're beautiful, and it used to just make me cry. Yes, don't do that. <laughs> That's my favorite song by her. It's so cute. Jesus, bright as the morning star. Jesus, Jesus how, how can I, I tell you how beautiful you are to me? Oh, it's so good. Yes. Sweeter than springtime. Purer than sunshine. Ever my song will be. Jesus, you're beautiful to me. Yes! I'm about to bring that back. I, oh. I'm about to bring it when back. When chaos is being chaotic. <laughs> Boy, first thing I go to. <laughs> Listen, I had broke my arm before I moved out here 2017. I had actually I got an apartment down in Newport Beach. I went to do a wedding and crazy, long story short, broke my arm. Shoot. I am cussing up a storm. I had never broken anything in my life. So mm-hmm. firemen, I'm trying to get me to calm down. I've never been in the hospital. They're like, hey, are you allergic to anything? They're trying to get out my mind. I was like, somebody give me something. Something. I'm going ballistic. I'm about to go mad. We get in this hospital room. I've been with a broken arm for like four hours. Nobody giving me anything uh-uh. so the doctor comes in he's like hey Darius we're still trying to just get your vital trying to figure out if you're alerting before we give you pain medicine I don't care I'll swell up give me right now he said what will help you I said listen if you don't put on some throne room Jesus is beautiful right please, now by CC Wines if y'all can get this message to me in the next two hours that's the only thing that'll do that's something that's it man that came on goodness <laughs> good gracious to go. yes good to go oh man yeah I can't stand it either actually I'm low key like freaking out um <laughs> Yes, that's that's a great Mount Rushmore, Mount Rushmore of gospel. Yolanda Adams, legendary. Yolanda, she doesn't stop. No. You think she's going to stop? No. It's like even her range, but then it's what she does, how she repeats words, repeats phrases, repeats, I love her. Kim is just dumb. She's just, if you want to, like people ask me how I started riffing and running and mm-hmm. stuff. Oh, first of all, I don't, she's like really a runner. Yeah. I just have moments where it's yeah, like yeah. I ran. Right, yeah, yeah. She, no, she yeah, she runs. It was her yeah. and Brandy. Those were that's how yeah. I got into like precise runs cuz theirs are so precise that if your pitch is weird, right. there's just no way you're going right. to accomplish it. <laughs> right. Yeah. yeah, so Yes, definitely. Man, that's so good. Kim has the way that she even hears stuff. If you're like, how did you hear how that? How do you, yeah. If I play you the one, how did you start on the flat five and end up here? I don't get it. But she does, and it's always perfect. And people are not singing like that no more. No, sadly. <laughs> that's all right. God bless everybody's hearts <laughs> and their parts, as yeah. my grandmother would say. I mean, I'm not mad. I love a vibe. I do love so, a vibe, too, yeah. yeah. Yeah, I'm not mad. Yeah. It is like... The chances people used to take in the uh, you know eighties nineties all the way to two early two thousands, it was fun. It made music fun, and it made I know it made me a better singer. That I heard this stuff all the time. There's this yeah. video of Mariah. There's this video of Mariah Carey. I'm about to pull it up because I literally just sent it to Keisha like two days ago. Oh, bet. Um, and I'm like, 
who and how did you think of this? Yeah. Um, and also, she didn't breathe like the entire time. I just want to. I want to understand. Is this early Mariah too? I'm about to show you. Yes, she's like little baby. <laughs> What? Jesus. She has still not taken a breath. Yeah. Who is doing it like this? Control. Who is doing it like that? Control. That's what I want to know. Dang it. That's amazing. There you go. Yeah. See, that's the kind of thing. You know her trainer was Melanie Daniels. Are you familiar with Melanie Daniels? Mm Mm-mm. It rings a bell, though. Melanie is the light-skinned like, girl that can like do it all. She does all of that. She's from New York. She sings at the AME church. Oh, my god. Flat gosh. out crazy. But she also has a very low voice, too. Insane. I'd wow. Sure yes. But she has... That's what Melanie's known for. So oh, I'm sure wow. she was... Yeah. She's probably helping her out. Yep. Yep. That's that's crazy. Man, okay. We'll get down. I'll go down. I don't even go, need to go down this train because it'll be... <laughs> don't, yeah. We'll be here all night. Yeah, yeah. Welcome into the Mogul House Live, everybody. We got Aston. She just got done singing 24... I just can't take it no longer. I can't take it any longer. I gotta let it go. Yeah. <laughs> what were you about to play? I wasn't. I oh, okay, was okay. Just go ahead. Follow you. Oh, yeah. All right, one, one time. <laughs> I just can't take it no longer. This song gets me. It gets me so bad. I'm sorry. It gets me. Oh, man. Oh, Jesus. Yeah. It gets me. And I've had too many drinks. Um, Something to make me stronger. But if I had someone to lean on, you just wouldn't be the one. Yes. Right, let it go, let it go. Yes. Right, yeah. That's good. That's a good song, everybody. Is that coming out soon? All right. We'll let it go. What do you sing for us next? <laughs> <laughs> Not just. Yeah. Um, I think I'm gonna do another cover. Um. Yeah. Do you listen to Moses Sumney? I am unfamiliar. Okay, well, I'm prepared to have your ears blessed. Um, we have, what's the song called? Uh, Plastic. Plastic. Yeah. By Moses Sumney. By Moses Sumney. Everybody watching The Mogul House, my name is Bishop. We have Aston Tur here, and she's about to sing Plastic by Moses Sumney. Check this out. <clears throat> I know what it is to be broken and be bold. Tell you that my silver is gold That we're much too old for make-believe And I know what it's like to be hold and not be held It's funny how a stomach unfed Seems satisfied cause it's swell and swollen And you got me Shooting across the sky like a star But nobody told me To never let it get too far You see my silhouette And so you're standing scared of me mm-hmm. Can I tell you When you said you wanted to tell a secret, I was like, oh, just tell me. (laughs) 
God, just tell me. What in the world? <laughs> wow. Wow, what is wrong with you? Hey, man. It is a, it's a lot. There, this is... You don't hear stuff like this. I'm I'm literally gonna be so hyped when one day you're like you're selling out arenas and oh like my God. I sat next to her. Oh <laughs> my god! No, we ah. say it all the time. Somebody said Derry Bishop was walking around Walmart singing it for her. I'm hour. screaming. <laughs> <laughs> I was walking around was Walmart bad. talking about I just I can't, can't take, take it. <laughs> like I was fed up. God. Pissed. Good Pissed. Lord. This that was plastic. That's a beautiful song. All the chords. Okay, so guitar wise, you said I forget whose name. Leanne Lahavis. Leanne Lahavis in, inspired yeah. you. Do you like playing electric or acoustic more? Because you played electric one time and it was like, damn. Oh really? I I um like playing electric, but it intimidates me a lot. Oh yeah, me too. Yeah, I'm too. like, yeah. it's a lot. Uh, you're going to hear more mistakes on electric than you will on acoustic. Very true. So it's more revealing. Yeah. Um, and also, I just am so used to playing acoustic guitar. Yeah. It's like home. Uh-huh. Uh, but stuff like 24 or Too Soon even, mm-hmm. like they sound so good on electric. So yeah. I like doing that. And when I record them, yeah. or I'm... I am recording them. Hey! Wow, wow, wow. Um, it'll be more like electric mm. with a little bit of acoustic because I still Ooh. I still heavily, heavily funk with an acoustic vibe. Yeah. Even with, you know, more electronic right, right. sound or yeah. whatever. So. so you put out a record called Lullabies. On that record, it was strictly you, acoustic guitar, all the feels, making us feel all kinds of ways. On this one that's coming up, what are you are you feeling it's gonna be a lot like that vibe, just you and a guitar, or are you adding more elements to it? More, yeah. It'll be more, which is fun. Um I like I I write by myself most mm. times. Like mm. all the songs that you've heard tonight that are mine are like one hundred percent mine. So yeah. I write my songs in my room, like, and then that's it. Yeah. So I don't usually think to take it to, like, a next step musically unless it's, like, background vocals because that's, like, second nature to me and it's so fun to do. But, like, I think I just trust the people around me way Mm. more than I trust my own self to give, like, a cool sound to what I've already made. Mm -hmm. So anytime I, like, bring it to a band or something, I'm, like... The way I rehearse people is I'll play it one time through and mm-hmm. I'll be like, think about or like remember what feels most natural to you. Mm. Like whatever the song is like asking you to do. And then like let's try and figure out how to like put that in the best package possible. Yeah. Yeah. Just because, yeah, I'm not a bass player. So right. I don't know like right, right. what the best feel for that is going to be. But I know like three people who totally would. So yeah, do it. Yeah. 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 It'll like be that. more collaborative than that. The Lullabies is literally me in my dorm room um, wow. in my closet. So, wow. Yeah. Man, that's crazy. Yeah. Sing, sing me to sleep fast. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> yeah, right. Well, she can do that. Literally just push play. I've done it before. I did try that one time. I was like, all right, this is called Lullabies. I'm going to push play. And that thing sent me into a deep rest. <laughs> A deep one. Good God. Probably one of the best loops I ever had. It's like, you know how they have white noise? That was my yeah. white noise. And it's Amen. a that's a, a good white noise yeah. app. Y'all, Aston is here. I am telling all the things. Probably shouldn't be saying it all, but hey, we're here. Hey. Thank you guys for being Hey Kaylee, how you doing? Welcome in to the Mogul House Live. Hi, Pastel. I don't even know if I got to say hi to Pastel yet. Hello, hello, hello. Welcome in to all of the people in the chat. Much love to you all again. And thank you for all. I think we had a hype train starting right out, uh, blasting with Element OP. Don't y'all just love Element OP? Isn't he amazing? Good old Element He has all the, the great energy. Also, this rice situation was taking me completely out. Me, <laughs> me and Aston dying. Yeah. You guys are hilarious. Always love coming in here on Saturdays and hanging with y'all. Um, we have Aston Turner. Aston, what are you going to sing for us next? I'm gonna do. I'll I'll do some lullabies. Some lullabies. Yeah. My goodness. 
All right. We're going to have some lullabies. But before we get lullabies, I need to see a whole bunch, a whole bunch of lighters in the chat. It's about to go down in here. It's about to, all the feels about to hit y'all. Um, it's just the one like, mm-hmm. See, it makes you want to worship. <laughs> you know what? A lot of people say that about my songs, and I'm like, thank you. All right. Yeah. Like, what do you want me to do? Yeah. Well, I, I mean, that's sweet. I feel like, you know, I love you your just want to be in I love it. your response. <laughs> <laughs> That's sweet. That, <laughs> it is. It's like you just want to sit in it, and I yeah. think that is sweet. Yeah, I love it. Well, here's some lullabies from his ass and turd. Check this out.
just y'all listen y'all know i'm a, i'm never short of words i don't have a lot of words right now god you said let me help you undress mm-hmm. mm-hmm. you didn't have to add you didn't have to add that little bit on there god no man i know really upset about it so sleep when you said, let me help you on, let me help you on dress, Kyle, why? You know that what's so good. funny? When I wrote this song, I didn't think about how that could be, like, kind of, like, sensual. When I first read these lyrics, because I found them on Google, when I, I sing this on my stream. Uh-huh. Often. Oh, really? Oh, yeah. Aww. But I was looking, and I was like, I actually didn't think that. Okay, good. Yeah. I didn't think that until you sang it. This past weekend, I said, oh, I guess that could mean this, too. Yeah. No, I was literally thinking about, like, babies. Like, come yeah. here, little yeah. baby. I, let me help you. I thought I thought that. Or I thought, like, if especially if you were talking to your your significant other who's coming home from a long day, tired, whatsoever. It's like, yeah. that's one of the most probably the most caring things you could probably do for her mm-hmm. is to help them get into a, a state of rest. I, yeah. That's what I thought that meant. Okay, sweet. I wrote it thinking about, like... I, First of all, I wrote the lullabies because I was having a hard time sleeping for a minute, which is very unlike me. Like, mm. literally, I am the nap queen. I be going to sleep at 1130 and yeah. I wake up at 7. Like, I really, I don't play yeah. <laughs> about my sleep. <laughs> and, um, yeah, I, I was having a hard time sleeping. So I was like, okay, well, maybe I'll, like, you know, make the best out of me mm-hmm. having this whatever is going on. And then... Uh, yeah, I wrote that, and I was just thinking, like, damn. Remember when, like, your mom used to, like, come here? You know, yeah. let me help you right, wind yeah. down. Let me, like, rub your back. Right, let right. me, like, get you in your jammies. Right. Yeah, like, yeah, yeah. just go to sleep, baby. Yeah. Like, you're tired, <laughs> okay? Just go to bed. It's yeah. fine. That's what I was thinking about. Yeah. Um, but, yeah, that yeah. is a different way to... When, are you, So, you're are you kind of going in the most, like, purest form or simplest way saying... All, all, all the lullabies that this is kind of like a lullaby to a kid in a way yeah like okay. it it made me think about after i had finished them it it felt like my mom used to like sing us to sleep sometimes or she'd like sing us awake mm-hmm. in the morning so it's just kind of like that vibe more of like i don't know yeah whenever i i introduce this or them the lullabies at a show or whatever i always say like oh you can play it for your babies yeah or like your dogs, yeah. your cats, you <laughs> yeah. know. I never think like, oh, you can play them for your significant other. Yeah. You can. Yeah. Please do. But I literally <laughs> thought that's what you I when I heard them, I was like, man, this is it was it was just that's it's a different different tone towards um that special someone. Yeah, it is. Yeah. And yeah. that's I love how um music does that. Like yeah. you can take a song so many different ways. Right. Like, yeah. How do you take your tea? How right, do you yeah. take your song? Yeah, like yeah, yeah. your thought process about it is so different than mine, obviously. And yeah. that's cool. That's right, like right, what yeah. it's all about anyway, I think. That's like, true. Yeah. Interpretation and everything. Yeah. Oh, it's a we love a lullaby. We do closure. <laughs> wow, not my mom. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, Ben Tran, hello, welcome in. Good to see you. It was good to see you in person. Some of, so many of you were there for Untapped um, in person. It was always it's always great to meet you all in person to see the names and the faces come together. Um, so much love to everybody, and also thank you everybody for um, <laughs> Pastel. So can you sing that one again? Oh, okay, do you need her to sing you to sleep, Pastel? Uh, those who also were in the in the stream, like you guys. Y'all don't know how cool that was to see all of you in there. It's such a big, momentous occasion for us as Mogul House. And um, we are all like just so amped to bring so many of our friends that you don't know to this platform so that you can engage with them because uh, you all are special to us. So um, this is one of those amazing talents. It's just like, it's freaking amazing. Ain't that right, Sonata? It's amazing. 
Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Legendary moments. It is. It is. Uh, Indy Brothers. Also, Indy Brothers were part of the Ray Train. Much love to these guys over from uh, upstate New York. They're fabulous. Oh, brothers, cool. yeah. Yep, they're great. I think one of them is here right now, though, in California. So oh, they're split They're split apart for a weekend. Uh, but much love to the Indy Brothers in the chat. Um, and much love to everybody who came out to hang with us. How many songs do you have left? Was that it? No, I could do one more. You can do one more? Yeah. I wouldn't be upset. I mean, like, I could do one more. You know, yeah. Yeah. What would that be? I always end with this song. I should start getting, start, start singing a new song at the end. But it's just really like one of the best songs I ever wrote. Um, it's called Maybe It's Okay. This is the oh, one that's about one of the dumbest people I've ever. That's it. Yeah. 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 When you got done, you said something. I was like, oh, shit. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> you know what, dummy? Again, right. Wherever you are, I'm thankful. Yes. For, I'm thank you for the time that we had to spend together. I'm grateful y'all had the time too. Yeah, yeah. In order for me to write this song, I'm grateful for this song too. Would so, I give that time back to myself? One hundred percent. One hundred percent. Yes. Wow. Yeah. I sound so mean. No. When it comes to men, it, it men are not is. trash. Not all of yeah. them. Are you a Jasmine Sullivan fan? Yeah. <laughs> so, uh, do you know the whole tales? Come on. If 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 Asia were here, she'd be like, "Yes, the classy, because that's a classy hoe." Like, yeah. 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 H e a u x. Yes. Yes. Definitely. Yeah. Oh. But the way she, when she talks about heartbreak, even though there's one, uh, the the lost one song. It's more about how she messed it up, but the selfishness of it, I love that because I'd be, th Yo, be there sometimes. When that song first came out, I was singing it like I just got yes. bro I just yeah. got broken up with yes. or something. No, yeah. none of that was true, but yeah. I was in my car giving me, it to the me, people. Oh my God, that song me is too. so good. I don't know why I identify. With, I do know why because I've been that way before. Mm -hmm. There was one time I was like, Oh, that's very selfish, but I still don't care. And the way she starts it out with how you've coped. Because that's like, oh, I've definitely been there and coped like that to make myself feel better. And then come back home and realize, no, she's actually having a great no, time right yeah, now. No, yeah, you're having a great time. And you yeah. know what makes it worse? Social media. Oh, yeah. I don't want to <laughs> see you having a good time. Yeah. <laughs> if, if I'm sad about us, yeah. please don't post anything. Don't post nothing. Don't post anything. Just don't sorry. smile. <laughs> don't do none of that. Yeah. I don't want to see that. Yeah, yeah. Keep it to yourself. Definitely. I, I'm, I'm with you 100%. Oh, I love music. <laughs> it's wonderful. Well, Ass is about to hit us with this song uh, to the person she wishes that um, could be blessed and live his life the best. <laughs> <laughs> and I, I'm saying that politely, mostly. We're, I'm screaming. We're all giving him the middle finger in love tonight. I'm screaming. Uh, with this song. <laughs> yeah, let me get situated so I can play this right. Yes. All right. Uh, give me the name of this again. Uh, maybe it's okay. We have Aston Tur here at the Mogul House Live. It's your boy Bishop, and I'm sitting here with this queen of a musician and singer, Aston Tur. She's about to sing. Maybe it's okay. Check this out. slowly moving so but surely close to you close to you and just as much as I know just as much as I know I want to I don't want to bother you And I said to myself I don't have time But here I am losing my mind for you For you Oh, where did all my good sense go? find it I just don't know what to do am I into you mm -hmm. looking for you 
searching for you in everything I see. I just want to be around you. And I promised myself that I would try to not think about you. But who am I? How did I get into this spine when it's your smile that runs through my mind all day? I don't know what to say, maybe it's so. How much do I care for you or do I mind at all? Is this as big a deal as I'm making it? Well, if I say no, am I faking it? Well, I made this pretty bad and I must lay in it. Talking to Listening to every word you say Maybe it's okay Thanks for listening, guys. Thanks. Back you and threw you around vocally <laughs> and gave you these lyrics. <laughs> Man, I'm losing my mind. That is so good. Man, Thank you. if I could have your musical intelligence when I'm singing, because you just do things that I go, I didn't think to go to that note, which is awesome, or to end it with that that timbre and that texture and that all that stuff. You you got it, man. Thank you. you got I, it. I love to hear these things because I do not think like this. Really? Like, I'm not thinking like, oh, my God. Oh, my goodness. I want to end. That makes me even more this. upset. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, really? Yeah, I don't know. It's like, I I was telling my friend a few days ago, like, whenever I play and I'm, like, really in it, I am not there. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I'm literally, like, across the room. <laughs> and somehow it's working out and I'm, like, looking at myself doing what I'm doing. And I'm yeah. like, how would you do that? I don't Dang. know. Dang. Gosh, that's that's so annoying <laughs> and so great at the same time. <laughs> Dang, that's that's a, that you have a natural gift for sure, and it does come from what you've listened to. And you talking about Brandy? That's a lot that she falls to some of those twos, those nines, mm-hmm. and all you know. So I hear all that, man. <sighs> Thank you. Every word you say, yeah. I love that stuff. <laughs> I can't take this, y'all. It's just so wonderful. Thank you. I hope you guys, golly, right. (laughs) I've been trying to hold that back, man, but goodness. That is just awesome. You guys can find these songs on on Spotify. You can find them on any uh, streaming platform, actually. Actually, um, not all of them. Not all of them. Most of them you can't find. But oh, the low wow. is you totally can. Yeah. And there's a video of Maybe It's Okay on YouTube. What? Why did not I know that? Well, that's because I have them all on my Instagram. I just watch those, you know. <laughs> <laughs> Y'all, we have Aston Tur here. It's been awesome. Thank you for coming. Absolutely. Yeah. Thanks for having me. I am. I'm. I'm done. I don't know if I can take anymore. I'm frustrated within <laughs> my soul. My boy Cash Shy Towns in here. He absolutely drops everything. When I tell him you're about to sing, he's in Seattle. But he's like, oh, wait, wait, Aston? Okay. Aww, <laughs> thanks. He said yeah. we need more. We Ooh. need more. I know, right? I oh, my gosh. Do. I don't know. Like she, do. Y'all, she's been singing all night. We had to let her go. Somebody said one more. <laughs> Lonely said something early. I can't remember, but it blessed oh, me. Boy, so, boy, boy. yeah. Much love. Much love to all of you guys. Thank you for being here in the Mogul House Live. Oh, uh, They are calling for an encore. <laughs> Yeah, I'm trying to think about what I could play for you. Oh. 
Okay, I can do one more. Okay, she has an encore, and you see, it ain't take me no time saying say okay. <laughs> okay, <laughs> it was quick. Yeah. <laughs> so quick. What? I took off my strap and everything. Wow. I was really, yeah. <laughs> she was done. I y'all. was done. Yeah. Done. Done. All right. All right, we can do one more. Yeah. One more. We have one more coming from Aston. Um, an encore. She listened to the people. I'm a woman for the She's people. She's a woman for the people. You see? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Definitely. Man, are you a um are you an Indy Irie fan? Uh not super, but okay. I did used to listen to back, a few of her tunes growing up. Yeah. yeah. You know who you remind me of? Do you know Shantae? Uh is it C A Can maybe? Can, yeah. yeah. Yeah, yeah, she fo- she followed me on Instagram not too long ago. I would have shit myself. <laughs> <laughs> I I'm have. screaming. I'm gonna send her your uh, please do your videos. Yeah, just tell her that there are things that I watched her growing up that I do because of her. There's a wow. song she did with uh the, with Indy Reed. How do I know my God is real? But her tone is so straight and so perfect. Oh God! Anyways, you remind me of her, which is really amazing. Just Thank to, you. Yeah, potty. <laughs> Shut up, Key. <laughs> Get out. All right. What did he say? As he said, oh, potty, potty mouth. mouth. Sorry. They, these words just fly out sometimes. Me. There we go. Yeah. I don't feel as bad now. Aston cusses, so here we are. Yeah, I have. I got the mouth of a like sixty-five-year-old sailor man. <laughs> Where's crusty old sailor? Yeah, where, is cr- yeah, where is he? Where is he? Crusty old <laughs> sailor. Yeah. yeah. Well, she's going to sing one more. I don't know what this song is going to be, and honestly, I'm just going to let it happen. So, you're watching the Mogul House Live. My name is Bishop, and I have my good friend here, Aston Tur. Check this out. <clears throat> I've been here for a while Just about a billion miles away Giving my heart a break The way it gets lonely But I've been
Awesome. I'm so glad y'all came in. That was amazing. This girl is so good. If you want to find her, you can find her on all socials. I even seen somebody say Aston to Twitch. I mean, <laughs> you know, wait, where's we have it? Oh man, she's so awesome. And uh, much love for, for all of you being here tonight. Just an incredible night. Next week we'll be back here at this same time again at seven o'clock. We have an amazing guest coming next week. I will not be with you all, but. Uh, my boy, my boy Heathy will be with you guys and the streamer that's coming is going to be actually be very fantastic. You all, all probably already know her, so it's going to be exciting to see her. But Aston, thank you for being with us. Thank you for having me. Thank you for me. being with us. Much love to you guys again. Thank you for coming to the Mogul House Live. We'll see you this time next week at 7 p.m. right here at the Mogul House. Much love. Thanks, guys. Peace. share of them and I will